Well, hello. We are out in the kayak on the Hudson River. This is the first time I've tried this. Uh, we're launching out of Yonkers. It's a $10 launch fee. Parking's free on the weekdays. So I'm just kind of fooling around today. I guess we're going for big catfish or maybe maybe striped bass, but, but uh, I'll be happy with a big catfish. We're just here for a, a new, different experience and um, hopefully it all works out. So uh, come along. See the beautiful cliffs of the Palisades in the distance. Former Tappan Zee, now Como Bridge. Probably see Manhattan if you get past this rocky point. Right now we're just in about 9, 10 feet of water. Steady breeze. Nothing this kayak can't handle. Ooh, this is fun. I could get used to this. Okay, I'm gonna use a bait holder hook surf float rig. Again, I'm going for big fish. I have some big fish heads from previous uh, catches uh, right here in my bag. Uh, so I'm just gonna put a big old fish head on there. I'm just, you know, kind of relaxing today. Soak in the sun while I soak my bait. So yeah, I got scraps here. Perch, yellow perch is on the menu. Okay, something is peeling drag immediately. How could I have something so quick? I don't think I do, do I? No. See, this looks like a fish, but... Feels like something. No. Interesting. Okay guys, this wind is really kicking my ass. I don't know if you can see that dock and those buoys in the distance, but I keep ending up there within a minute or two. So I'm fighting again. I want to stay relatively close to this ramp, at least for my first time out. Um, so I did put the anchor down, which does uh, seem to be doing a good job of either stopping my progress that way or slowing me down for sure. I feel like there were definitely fish with the bait in their mouth and pulling on it because um, it wasn't just the loose drag being pulled out but when I would tighten the drag and pull in I would feel something you know pull, tugging on the other on the other side but um, I'd imagine you know with the, a big hook and big bait uh, you really gotta let them munch on it for a while or risk just not really getting the hook into them. You know, they just kind of have it hanging on the outside of their mouth. But uh, anyway, did I mention it's hot? Well guys, while I'm out here relaxing and letting the bait soak, I think back to mid-June, early June maybe, where after three or four attempts from the Yonkers waterfront from shore, uh, I finally caught a fish. So, it's just a couple brief clips. Unfortunately, I didn't have this camera with me. They were on uh, my wife's phone. But uh, I caught one. Someone else caught one. Channel Cats, check it out. Look at that Channel bad cat. boy. Kitty cat. 
first Yonkers fish. You got that on film, huh? Yeah. Not a bad catfish. But we don't keep catfish from the Hudson River. Oh, okay. Nice, clean. Got a few pictures. Catfish are nice and hardy. You can stay out of the water. You can stay out of the water a while. Oh, actually, I have my my fun grippers. My PB cat, caddy. I mean, they get way bigger I than mean, that. I mean, it's a big boy. Oh, he's trying to do the death spin. All right, babe. He is. Let's see. Wait, where's? Oh, I see. It's about four pounds. Party boy. Fish can stay out of the water a very long time. Wait, really? Yeah, in particular, yes. How, how long is it? Uh, like an hour? Maybe not an hour, but it, he'll be okay for however long this takes. Got it. See? Easy, easy. You want the honor of throwing it back? Sure, yeah. So and then you just, yeah, you just okay. pull it up. Didn't record. Didn't record. Hit that. Hit that. Hit that. We're back. Yay. Yes. Yeah. Well done, man. Well done. Of course. Good job, guys. Good job. 